nice night down here. Finally cooled off. That's what we've been looking forward to. I think with this cooler air temps, the Wahoo bite is really going to finally heat up. That water temperature will drop. I mean, that's what we need. And the water temperature has been in the low 80s still. So we really like that to be in the mid 70s down here, even low 70s if we can get it down that far. Walked out to the dock, take a look at the boat. We're going to work on a big walkthrough. We're already working on it. It's going to be done by the weekend. A really detailed walkthrough video. Very, very comprehensive. Very comprehensive. I'm going to talk about why I chose the Sea Hunter 41. I'm going to talk about the differences, legit differences, between this boat, the Freeman 42, the Invincible 40. Those are great rides, no question. But they're just a little bit different, right? Each boat is unique, and I want to share with you in detail the unique features of this particular particular boat that really made me choose this for the future of Florida Sport Fishing TV. Really cool stuff. A lot of it that I, I promise you, you've never heard of or didn't even know. So just came out to take a look at the boat, gather my thoughts. And, you know, you look in the water here, we've got some some of these underwater lights and i mean just look at the abundance look at the tarpon they were just fired up tonight Ooh, there they go. Oh. <laughs> bunch of schoolies you know fish anywhere from 10 to about 50 pounds here tonight but they're in here and they're in here thick again it's that temperature drop that's really got them fired up they'll feed they'll feed like this as long as the water is moving you can stay out here and watch them feeding and all of the lights it's really a, just a magical experience right to have like a live aquarium with tarpon in your backyard everybody says hey do you fish for them and i do you know but not intentionally every day when we get back you know from fishing maybe we throw a bait out so somebody can jump a poon or two i did one the other day but it's not like we go hey let's go tarpon fishing off mike's dock and i think that's a great idea right would you fish off the dock for tarpon <laughs> so look at them yeah they're fired up there that's really really cool so hey guys want to just remind you one more time stick around this comprehensive review on the c hunter 41 cts powered by the quad mercury 400 v10s with the electric steering i'm telling you man this boat is absolutely incredible I want to remind everybody, guys, check out our streaming site, Florida Sport Fishing TV Plus. That's where all the instructional videos are. That's where you're going to catch all of the episodes of Florida Sport Fishing TV, our new series, Captain Mike's Rigging Station. It's all there, exclusive content, all kinds of instructional stuff. Heavy focus on fishing the Keys? Yeah, because I'm down here in the Keys. Heavy focus on, focus on South Florida in general? Absolutely, because we were up you know, for 25 years in Broward County, fishing out of Hillsborough Inlet, Boca Inlet, you know, that whole area, the Bahamas. So just a ton of information. Certainly we have fished over in the Gulf in different areas, inshore and off, so you'll be able to pick up a lot of tips there. It's fsftv.com. No YouTube ads, 27 cents a day. Guys, 27 cents a day and you can get hooked up. Shorten the learning curve. Go from zero to hero in one fish. I mean, come on, it's an absolute no-brainer. And if you're not 100% satisfied, 100% satisfied, if you really don't believe the value is there, and if I'm not helping you on the water, no problem. Call me, I'll refund every penny. I don't care where it is, I'll refund every penny. So check it out, fsftv.com. I'm looking forward for you to get hooked up.